New details on the legal troubles for President Trump's former attorney, Michael Cohen. A state investigation could now come into conflict with the federal case in which Cohen has already pleaded guilty to eight counts, including tax evasion. CNN's Erica Orden has the uh, story. So tell me what you know. Sure. So what we know is that today, New York state tax investigator, investigators are scheduled to meet with Michael Cohen's attorney, Guy Petrello. Uh, the, the inquiry on, from the tax department in this case um, involves a tax fraud examination regarding the Trump organization, and that stems from some of the um, in material that were, or information that was included in the federal charges against Michael Cohen that were brought in August by the U.S. Attorney's Office for the Southern District of New York. Mm -hmm. As with any ongoing criminal investigation or criminal case, federal prosecutors usually don't want um, other offices from taking certain investigative steps that might potentially interfere with their with their case, and in um, in this matter, we know that the U.S. Attorney's Office has dissuaded other offices from doing that at this moment until their until their case regarding Cohen and some of the other related matters is over. Is part of those eight counts when he pleaded guilty uh, downtown a couple weeks ago, one of which was a campaign finance violation, right? And so you right. and I were talking in commercial break that the Southern District of New York also has an inquiry into that. The Southern District of New York has an inquiry that stems from their Cohen investigation, and that is a, uh, a probe into potential campaign finance violations by the Trump organization as opposed to Cohen himself.